a safety alert tonight after an 11 year old girl says a man offered her candy if she'd get into his car. Police say it happened after she got off the school bus yesterday at the intersection of school and Monroe streets in Two Rivers. NBC 26's Ashley Barnes is live in the newsroom with what police are doing now to keep your kids safe. Stacy, it is a scary thought, but one that can happen anywhere. And it's why police are asking, what would your child do if approached by a stranger? I asked her to get into his vehicle. He told her he had candy and they would go to the park and eat it. Lieutenant Sean Engelman is talking about a possible child enticement case. The important thing is to get away. Tuesday afternoon, an 11 year old girl says she got off the school bus and a man in a car approached her offering candy. Lieutenant Engelman says she handled the situation well. She did. She did what she was supposed to. She ran away and um, had her uh, grandmother call 911. She actually did give a very good description of the vehicle of the suspect. A description that's helping police look for that suspect. And while Engelman is looking as a cop, he's also a concerned parent and knows it takes a village. The more people we have looking out for a possible suspect vehicle. Uh, the better off we are. Other neighbors in Two Rivers noting that times are changing. It's less safe. The issue also a wake up call for many. In Two Rivers, we have a very low crime rate. But a reminder for parents to talk to their kids, making sure they don't fall for stranger danger. And three things that could help save your child's life in a situation like that pointing out safe places for them to go when they are in danger, but also using the buddy system if they do have to walk home alone. And then also being assertive, letting kids know that it's okay to say no to a strange adult. Reporting live in the newsroom, Ashley Barnes, NBC 26.